Hi guys, so I bought this Adeptus 6 Draw Cab Damp and it's solid wood so I was happy about that. Started to look at the instructions and what you need is a Phillips head screwdriver, a hammer, and a rubber mallet. I would really recommend using the rubber mallet for most of it because you don't want to, when you're putting in the draw guides, you don't want to crack them at all by hitting it too hard with a hammer. So I got out, so I took all the pieces out of the box, got everything kind of organized, and then Jimmy said, I want to get your um, cordless screw gun. And I said, okay. And then I started with this, which was step one, is to put these draw guides into the sides there are holes already and then you just simply bang them. You don't screw them in, you bang them in. And it says hammer, but we found out that we did have an issue with when Jimmy took over, banged one and it cracked and I was like freaking, right? Um, but we had an extra from that other one. So we used that. But I'll tell you what, their customer service is top notch because if you look on the brochure, it says just to go to their website and then you order a new draw guide right there and they send it right out to you. You can actually order any piece that is damaged. And it's an easy process. So, yes, would I recommend this cabinet 100% because it's got a great construction. It's easy to build, went together well, it looks nice, sturdy, and it comes in three finishes. It comes in white, black, and this natural uh, this honey pine. Oh, and I think, please, I, wait, I think it comes in four finishes, and I, I think it has a natural unpainted one, so if you wanted to stain it a certain color or paint it, you could do that. Now, these are, I don't know how they compare to the Ikea ones. I don't even know if the Ikea ones are solid wood or not that kind of look like this. I have to get my craft room going. I would love to have a bunch of, of these in different sizes. Now, unfortunately, this company, it looks like only makes two sizes of this cart. One's a little narrow. I originally bought this to put my new printer on, but now I'm actually liking it for going under my desk that I have my computers on and I have to get this craft room somehow put together but I'm gonna let you see how easy this goes together and then you know if this is something that you like I'll put a link to the unit it really is uh, a nice piece I did order it from walmart.com but I believe it's also available on Amazon I'll put links for them in the video description and if you have any questions, just ask. And um, I'm just being funny with this now. Fanning him with the thing while I'm waiting for him to take this. But okay, thanks for watching, guys. I'll let you go through this. As, as DeVita would say, I'll put you to music now. But we'll say something at the end, too. Don't miss it. <laughs>
Okay, there you have it guys, all done. It's on wheels, which is nice, it's portable. It's very nice, it's a nice unit, very happy with it. And I hope that this video was helpful to you. So thanks for watching guys, if this was helpful, how about smashing the likes on the way out and let me know if you have this card in the comments and anything that you use it for that might be helpful. Everyone have a great day and God bless. Bye bye now. Thank you for watching.